here on this Thirsting for God Thursday. Amen. Here in at Acts 29, Church Under God, and uh, appreciate everybody showing up, and I believe God's going to show himself, because he was here before any of us got here. After all, it's his house. Amen. And you know, in Matthew 9, 2, there was some men that brought their friend who was sick with palsy and brought him to where Jesus was preaching in Peter's house. They couldn't get in the door. There was too many people there. It was crowded, so they had to take him up the wall, tear the roof off. And it said in Matthew 9, 2, and Jesus, seeing their faith, amen, said to the sick of palsy, thy sins be forgiven you. And you know how the story goes on. Jesus said, because he knew the Pharisees doubted that he was God and who are you to forgive sins? He said, so I'm going to say to the sick of palsy, take up your bed and walk to show you I have power on earth to forgive sin. Amen. He healed the sick of palsy. But Matthew 9, 2 says, Jesus, see in their faith. Some ought to say Jesus is looking for faith. And some ought to say faith in God has a look. Some ought to say it can be seen. In other words, it has action to it. Some ought to say it's not faith in God if it don't have an act. Amen. Praise God. There's even a book in the New Testament. Amen. The protocol for the modern church. It's called the book of Acts. And it's not just the acts of the Holy Ghost. But it also is the acts of the apostles. It's the acts of the believers. Because when the believer acted on what God said, then the acts of the Holy Ghost came and manifested on the stage of their faith. Some I say my faith in God is a stage where I must step along with my works in obedience to what he says to do. And when I do what he says, then he does what he says. Amen. Praise God. So even though we expect the acts of God, some ought to say God can't act until we act. Amen. In other words, we've got to do what God tells us to do. So Jesus saw their faith, seeing their faith. Amen. Some ought to say faith in God should be seen. It has an action. And he saw them, some ought to say, they came to the house. And said, so tonight I applaud you. Amen. I can see your faith. You're present in the house. Some people's got a confession of faith, but they don't have an action of faith. In James 2.18, James was talking to a man that he later on called Old Vain Man. And he said, this man said, I, you know, you got works and I got faith. And he told old brother James, he said, I'll show you my faith without works. Amen. And James said, old man, I'll show you my faith by my works. Somebody say, we start in faith. It's not of works. We get saved by faith through grace. It's not of works, lest any man should boast. Ephesians 2, verses 8 and 9. Somebody say, but after we experience saving faith, then we start operating in serving faith. In other words, our faith has works. And that's what James was saying. He was saying, if all you got is a confession of faith, all you can say is, I got faith, but you don't never do what it is you say you have faith for or faith in, you don't live different. You don't walk. You don't work it. Somebody say it won't work if you don't work it. And he called him a vain man. Amen. And he told him his faith without works was dead. James 2.20. Somebody say there is a thing called dead faith. I call it religious dead faith. It'll express faith in God with its lips. But like we've said many times around here, you won't find any faith of God in its hips. In other words, it won't walk what it's proclaiming. Amen. Praise the Lord God. So Jesus saw their faith. I see yours. You're in the house of God. Amen. Praise God. Somebody say people that have faith in God, one of the ways their faith is seen and shown, amen, is they just come to God's house. Ain't that what the men did? They came to where Jesus was. And Peter's house became Jesus' house because Jesus was on stage wherever that was inside that house wherever he was at that was the stage amen amen and Jesus was preaching and that's why they came there amen and their friend left healed and whole amen they carried him in on a bed and amen he carried his bed out I guess or left it there amen praise God but anyhow they carried him in and he left walking come on anybody hear the Holy Ghost praise God so their faith was seen amen look at somebody besides and say I can see your faith. I can see your faith. Amen. Tell them, say, I can see it in that you're here. Amen. Praise God. Somebody say, my faith is present. Hallelujah. It's relevant and it's in action. Amen. Praise God. Too many today, sadly, religiously are missing in action. Praise God. So thank you for being in the house of God with us tonight. I'm